Olivia, you are so nosy. What did Max say? How's it, ladies? Where's the old man? I beg your pardon? Duplessis. We are to celebrate the old reprobate's birthday. Oh, cool. Are you friends of Anders? Oh, well, we sure as hell aren't the strippers, lady. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're doing. Checking the fences. <laughs> you're keeping me away from the house so they can organize some god-awful birthday party. What party? My 60th birthday party. 60th? I have no idea. Many happy returns. Yeah, you're the worst liar I ever met. What did I say? No fuss, no bother. I don't celebrate my birthday. I don't celebrate anybody's birthday. Well, what could I do? Once Caroline had the idea for a party, yeah. the kids wouldn't stop talking about it. Gone and man just got old in peace. Hey, hey, slow down. I've got to keep you out here for another two hours. Two hours? While they get the house ready. Yeah, well, I haven't eaten. <sighs> There's a couple of noms as pies in my bag. You'll live. If I wanted a party, I would have asked for one. Happy birthday, you grumpy old git. Hey! We could borrow one of the young lions from Mara. Saves a few quid. No, I don't want any other lions yet. They'll fight for dominance of the pride. I hope he will lose. I'm going to throw Obi away like an old shoe. Forget it, my friend. That's just not going to happen. I... Sometimes you come here and nothing. No, I'm not having any of it. Why not? Because I don't like playing God and I don't want to see Obi get killed. Well, if Obi's got any sense, he'll just slink off for a couple of days. <laughs> Some bananas. You don't know Obi. You'll fight to the end and he will get killed. Thank you. Yeah, well, we don't know that, and we've got to take a risk. It's easy for you to say. Look, the young Mara lion will cover our lionesses, hopefully get them pregnant, and we'll trick Obi into thinking they're his. It's not a very honourable thing to do, eh? Yeah, we're going to have to castrate Hobie at the same time, too, to make sure he's not weakening our pride. Why not just dress him in a big tutu and get it over with? Come on, Duke. If we ignore this, our pride will dwindle to nothing, and you know it. Yeah, yeah. I will never forget that. Thank you so much, Rosie. You're very welcome. So, how long does it take to get all those animals together like that? Sorry? <laughs> I've been to zoos that have been less organized than that. I'm sorry. For town, it was so desperate for you to be impressed. <laughs> and I kept on seeing his fat head pop over the grass. <laughs> Please don't be cross with him. You know, he's very proud of Mara, and he wants everyone to have a wonderful time. I never get cross with people who show initiative. What's behind that gate over there? That's my family's game park, Leopard's Den. Oh, could I see it? I don't think Fatani would like that. <laughs> I'm not asking for Tony. It's just a modest little place, nothing like Mara. Cue me, Rosie. I'd really like to see it. He's magnificent. Oh, he's aggressive. I mean, he's taking over the leadership of the biggest pride. So what happened to the old Pedro? Stuffed and on the wall above the bar. And you don't mind us borrowing him for a few days? Be my guest. You're very cheerful. Oh, God's in his heaven and all is well with the world. Just, just um, give me some cubs when they're born. Your boss enjoying herself. Oh, how could she not? Your daughter's out there with her now and Rosie is something else. She has her moments. <laughs> I don't know about this, Danny. Something doesn't feel right. Well, it is right. Come on, let's go home. That stinking hot, I say to do this. You stay in How are they, Max? Thirsty. Do you know them, Nom, sir? Yes. 
What do you think? They are horrible. <laughs> you have a great gift for cutting to the heart of the matter, Nom, sir. Mrs. Duplessis wouldn't allow them onto the property. Maybe I should go and rescue Evan and Olivia before they get corrupted. What was Mrs. Duplessis like, Nom, sir? Oh, she was very beautiful. Come. We all loved her very much. Beautiful and calm. You've got no chance. Yeah, you go get him, boy. Huh? Lights down low. Bit of Sinatra. Bob's your uncle. Hope he's not getting any younger. Yeah, which is why we're doing this. Yeah, well. We release another line in here. Hope you'll fight to the death and get him. Well, there isn't another way. And we need new blood. Look, just because you're old, getting older, and hope he's not in his first flush doesn't mean a thing. What are you on about, Trevenia? You're not connected. Hope he's not a metaphor for your life. What's well, so if Hobie gets ripped to pieces tonight, I mustn't take it personally. Hey. We better get back. We're expected. Danny. For he's a jolly good fellow. For he's a jolly good fellow. Can't you just shoot me? Well, gladly, but you're the guest of honour. Caroline, it looks really, really good. Mm. Yes. Mm. Not that anyone will notice it. Oh, good, Max. Will you put it right down on that table? Mm -hmm. Yes, Duplessis and his friends will skip the champagne and go straight to the cleaning fluid. <laughs> well, I think it looks fantastic. What do you think, Nob, sir? I'll go and hide the cleaning fluid. <laughs> <laughs> now, remember, a lot of people have put a lot of effort into this. Yeah, yeah. Glad I didn't ask them to. You will be surprised. You will be delighted. I'd rather have my teeth pulled with rusty pliers. Surprised. Delighted. Yeah, yeah. They're coming! They're coming! Oh, oh, oh. Surprise! Happy birthday, Arthur! What was the last thing I said? I don't do birthdays. Hmm? I made you this. And I don't do presents. Show some grace, old man. Yeah, come on, <laughs> open it. It's Abby Girl, our first big cat. Oh, Aww, yeah. Aww. Thanks, boy. I looked up the friends page in your address book, and there were two names in it. <laughs> what? Very <laughs> <laughs> <Betty> Cory. <Curry. laughs> I don't believe it, Ben. Hey, throw the old man. Go. Hey, hey, hey. So beautiful. Thank you. It's just a drop in the ocean compared to Mara. What's business like on this side of the fence? Good, thank you. Shall we? Uh... Actually, I need the bathroom. Oh, right. Well, just make a bit of noise and scare the snakes away. <laughs> You've got to be joking. I'll look the other way. Just take me to the nearest bathroom, please. Mara's about half an hour away. Half an hour? But there must be something closer. <laughs> hey, that was a good one, eh? <laughs> right, right. Now go on me. One, two, three. I'm really sorry to get crushed like this. <laughs> not a problem when a girl's got to go. Are these all guests? Sadly not. Friends. <coughs> sort of friends. <sighs> and how long have you and your brother been involved in game catches? 20 years. More. Yeah. You see, we've got a surfeit of wildebeest. Now, it wouldn't really be a big...